Hey guys, thank you so much for checking out Beauty on a Budget. Today I'm going to be doing a little something different than what I usually do. I'm going to be trying out this um, acne fighting mask put out by Yes2. Um, so I've got to wash my face and then we'll get started. Alright y'all, so it's time to get started with the mask. I got all my makeup off, or I tried to get most of it off. Um, so this is put up by Yes2 Tomatoes Acne Fighting Paper Mask. Um, let's see, it, it works because it has tomatoes and sicilic acid. It controls pimples and blackheads or acne. Um, so this is on Amazon right now for $2.83. And it got five stars by Amazon, so that's really good. So, um, this is not like a mask mask. This is like a paper mask, so um, we won't be like rubbing anything on the skin today. But I did get a mask like that um, that I will review probably tomorrow. Um, so, let's get into it. I've never used one of these masks before, so hopefully um, it'll go good. <laughs> Directions say how to use gently unfold the mask and apply it to your skin. Um, adjust around your eyes, nose, and mouth, smoothing to fit the curves of your gorgeous face. Um, and then close your eyes and relax for 10 minutes and remove mask and dispose. So this is what it looks like when it comes out of the pack. It's really wet. It's hard. It's like a, it's like a wipe, like a towelette type wipe. Okay, here we go. It's coming undone now. I hope you can see this. I hope I'm holding it up high enough for you to see it. Okay, so here's the face. Um, let's see how this is gonna work. You see all this stuff? Can you see all this stuff on it? <laughs> it's like soapy stuff. Oh, and I was gonna tell y'all that I don't, I don't really have say acne. But um, I've had like a few bumps pop up and some over here a little bit. I don't know why. Like I didn't have acne as a teenager at all. So I guess I guess I said I guess I'm going to have it now. I'm 34. So but anyways, let's try this. <laughs> oh, it's cold. So, it sticks to your face really good. Ugh, it feels good. It'd be really good to do this in the summer. Just because it feels so cold. <laughs> Not great to do it in the winter, but it feels pretty decent right now in my house. So, so just smooth it in. Pull it down as much as you can. And you want to get all your skin covered. Just smooth it in really good. You can still talk, so um, that's good. So yeah, I'm hoping 
this helps what little bit of those bumps that I do have. So, okay. What do y'all think? Do you think this is all good? It's still wrinkly, but it's not, it's gonna be hard to get all the wrinkles out. I'm looking in my mirror right here too, so I'm not looking right at the camera though. The whole time. Okay. So, um, I'm going to leave this on for 10 minutes. And, um, I will come back and take it off. And, um, I'm assuming that this is not going to be, well, I know this is not going to be one of those things that just, you know, you don't see immediate results. Um, but I'm going to let you know how my face feels. Or how my skin feels. So, um, in 10 minutes, I will be back. All right, so this has been on for about 10 minutes, maybe a little bit longer. So I wanted to tell you before I take it off, it started to kind of burn, but not like severely, you know, not to where you just wanted to take it off. I really felt like it was, I mean, it's got salicylic, salicylic, I'm sorry, however you say that, acid in it. So I'm, I was just kind of expecting it to burn a little bit. Um, so. Um, if you try this and it burns a little bit, I don't think you should worry about it. Um, now if you have very sensitive skin and you start to really burn, then I would say take it off. But just a little bit doesn't, I don't think would be an alarming thing. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and take it off. Um, let's see, we'll take it off from the forehead. Oh, it just fell off. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, it didn't say to do anything like after, it just says to dispose of this. So you can't use this more than once. Um, or at least they don't recommend that you do. <laughs> um, there's still like, I think this stuff, it's like sort of like, um, it's like a cleanser on the mask. So I feel like this stuff is kind of gonna be working on your skin even after you take the mask off. So, um, it feels um, refreshing. That's kind of the way it feels right now. Um, you know, hopefully, maybe tomorrow or something, I'll see like these few bumps that I have on the side of my face maybe start to to go away. That would be great because um, it's there's nothing like being an adult and having some bumps on your face, like especially when you didn't have that when you was a teenager. Because I didn't have anything like. Well, I might have had a bump or two just like on my nose or my chin, but. You know, when you're a teenager, you don't think much about it, um, or you don't worry too much about it. It's expected, but I didn't have but just a few. And now I'm like, I feel like I was breaking out, like, so that's why I chose this mask. Um, but like I said, tomorrow I'll have another one that, um, it's like a clay mask. Um, so that one will be actually truly applying it, which I'm actually looking forward to that because I've never done one of those either. So, um... Yeah, I feel like, you know, I didn't have any kind of bad reaction to it or anything, and um, my face feels, just feels refreshed, I guess. That's the only way I know how to describe it, so. But I'll give it a good review. Um, I mean, I can't really tell you much about how it's going to affect my face as far as the bumps go until, like, a day or two from now. But it doesn't have any bad effects so far, um, so... Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, hope it was beneficial to you in some way. It is on sale at Amazon, or it's not on sale, but it is for sale on Amazon for $2.83, I believe is what I said. Um, and it did have five stars on Amazon, so it's probably pretty good. Um, so anyways, I will see y'all again. Um, like and subscribe and share if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.